We are here at the Swayambu Hill where the most powerful Swayambu Stupa is and after the earthquake there is so much damage, much more as one can be perceived on photographs. So behind me is the Bhutanese Gompa which was given uh, to the people of Bhutan approximately 300 years ago but the king of Kathmandu died in the Gorkha king in those times. Later, approximately 100 years ago, the great Bhutanese master, Shirab Doji Rinpoche, stayed here while renovating the stupa, and also our beloved Lobon Sechu Rinpoche stayed here many, many years. I say something? Yes. The stupa, the stupa stands, stands good. Behind the stupa, we have the monastery of Shaman Rinpoche, and the monastery of Shamanim, which is also badly damaged and also will probably have to be fully demolished. I just like yesterday to have a day together with Dr. Rinpoche, I came to the Swami Mustupa. The Stupa stands there are things but so many things are being demolished. The monastery of Lakon Sechu Rinpoche, the monastery of Shaman Rinpoche, so many houses here around, it will look much worse as whatever we saw on the photographs when we in the At the Swayambu Hill, 32 houses have been completely demolished by the earthquake. Apart from the monasteries, also 32 houses have been completely demolished here on the hill of Swayambu Stupa. At the moment, the Karmapa and Shamanak Relief Committee is providing for one month food, water, whatever is needed for everybody who lost here their houses. It's 200 people plus the army, plus the police, plus the workers who help here. It's around 300 people who are every day supported by the Kamapa Shamapa Relief Committee. Ah. Oh. 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 Oh.